harvest. It's so awesome just to give you an update today. It's kind of different because we just found out yesterday that we're entering into stage three. Phase and you know, three. Phase three, what does that mean? It means we get to go to a restaurant. Wow. Where are you taking me? We never went to restaurants anyway. Oh, wow. <laughs> so. I'm boom, bam. <laughs> uh, but you know, Heart of the Family, we're back open. We opened yesterday and it's super different. Um, we're operating with a lot less children, but in phase three, I'm super excited because some of our classrooms are going back to regular size. Oh, that's awesome. And it means we're gonna be able to operate a little more normal, but it's our new normal, right? It's not gonna be the same as right, it was right. until it returns there, which is, where are we as a church? I know you wanna hear about what's happening at Harvest. Well, congratulations on opening. Tell them, Johnny. <laughs> yeah, congrats on opening Heart of the Family. I think that's amazing, and I know that so many workers in Cornwall need that care. Yeah. So yesterday was announced at phase three and we are working with the Ontario Health Department. I have made contact to find out how does phase three affect places of worship. And so we'll let you know as soon as we know, just as a reminder, uh, what is um, kind of holding us back is not the 30% capacity, but rather the ability to worship in a style that suits us. And so the Ontario Health Department, as it was, was saying, no singing and no child care and so we've contacted them to see if that's changed yeah. and to see if we can offer a plan that we could offer care for our children where they'd be safe and as well as that we would be able to safely sing and worship here at Harvest yeah. and so as soon as we hear we're so excited uh, that uh, we could get together again we'll let you know but for this Sunday uh, 9 15 we have one one service stream so some of you have to get up a little bit earlier and uh, and you need to uh, really, uh, really make the effort. I have already seen this week's worship set. You were singing this week's yeah. worship set. Yeah, it and was awesome. There was a sense of the Holy Spirit on that recording. It was pretty, pretty profound. It was amazing. I remember Karen saying after, like, what did you think? And it's like, I think Jesus met us that night. I really yeah. do. I so, think it was a real profound time. And we believe that Jesus isn't stuck in time or space. So even though that recording has already happened, we really believe you're gonna experience something special in worship. And Karen Brink is sharing uh, the next part of Dangerous Prayer, Send Me. Hey, have an amazing week. We don't wanna send her though. No, we would we rather not her send her. But Jesus, <laughs> might, Jesus might send her. Eek. We're yeah. praying against that. Are we? No, I don't think we're supposed to no, do that. No, we can't. Okay, okay Jesus, Sandra, we'll let Have us. an amazing week. <laughs> we love we'll, you. We'll keep you up to date. Love you so much.